Welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial. Today we are going to do some fun in SOLIDWORKS. Today we will make this angry bird in SOLIDWORKS. So let's see how to do in SOLIDWORKS. It is very easy and simple way. I wish you like it. So now let's start here. We will select front plane, sketch, select line and draw one vertical line and it must pass through origin. Choose the smart dimension. Select the overall length 70 mm and define the distance from origin point to top line 30 mm. Ok, choose this line. Draw a one half curve. Connect one end to another end. Exit. Now select this line. Select this point arc horizontal. This bottom also select make relation with horizontal. Ok. Now select this center point. Right click. Delete. Choose the smart dimension. Now define the length. 140.08 mm. One seventy nine point nine two mm. Okay. Now select revolve boss base. Select the center line as a axis. Okay. Now this is the body for Angry Bird. Now we will we will do one thing. We will sketch one geometry. So choose front plane, sketch, normal. Define the vertical lines. draw two horizontal lines select both the line first to make relation horizontal okay now define these lines keep the gap 1 mm and the gap between these two lines 13.4 mm ok now choose line and start from uh, we will start from origin point tangent and little taper exit choose mirror entity and select these three lines mirror against this vertical line ok now let's define the angle 30.22 degree length 20 mm 4.5 mm and select this width 2.6 mm ok that's it now choose 3 point curve select this point up to this line ok now again choose this point to this point ok exit now let's define twelve point five mm seven point one mm ok select mirror select these two points and mirror against this vertical line ok choose line and connect both the end exit ok now this is the shape for choose here center point arc select this line and draw one arc from this line to this exit now define the dimension 
distance from corner uh, from center line 7.25 mm and select the radius 6.25 mm okay choose offset entity keep here one and select this line reverse direction okay trim entity and trim external lines okay select mirror and select these two lines and mirror against vertical line okay now again choose center point arc select this line and this line exit keep radius 2 mm and the distance from here 5 mm okay choose mirror this circle against center line okay three point arc now we want to connect these two points we want to make a beak or okay mirror against this line again choose three point arc this point to this point exit select these two lines make relation tangent okay now mirror this lines against center line cancel it delete this line and uh, select line okay now mirror this lines against this line now connect from both the lines okay now this whatever dimension you can keep it's up to you so this is the our main geometry just simply exit <coughs> now let's try to extrude now here choose this upper edge offset from surface 2 mm select this surface select here reverse merge result okay now see now select this and define the color black okay now let's try the another parts eyes so select this geometry show select this geometry sketch now select here this inside face this circle this circle this face and this inside face select here offset from surface select this body outer body and here 1.5 mm thickness reverse reverse offset means it will comes out merge result okay now select this face and uh, make the color black okay now again choose the same sketch offset now this time select this face offset select the surface 1 mm reverse okay now see it knows and everything comes and uh, this one we will allow the color white the white plastic okay now here we want to create some sketch select front plane 
प्लेन एंड क्रिएट वन प्लेन जस्ट पैरल टू फ्रंट प्लेन थर्टी फाइव एम एम हियर ओके नाउ सेलेक्ट दिस प्लेन स्केच नॉर्मल एंड सेलेक्ट दिस बैकग्राउंड ज्योमेट्री क्लिक कन्वर्ट एंटिटीज नाउ सी एग्जिट नाउ अगेन चूज द सेम प्लेन स्केच नॉर्मल सेलेक्ट दी बॉटम लाइन्स कन्वर्ट एंटिटीज एग्जिट नाउ वी कन्वर्टेड दी ज्योमेट्री हियर नाउ सेलेक्ट राइट प्लेन स्केच नॉर्मल hide this plane now see here this geometry is we create converted so first do one thing select this line convert entities okay choose line and draw a line then convert it into a arc or exit choose three point arc now let's define 25 mm length okay this radius is it's up to you whatever you need keep it now see okay now simply exit now we created a path for beak for now choose here 3d sketch select spline and connect from this point to its beak exit now select this and change according to the requirement take little up exit now try i think cancel it we need to edit this design and delete this line trim yes we need only half big okay exit now let's try swift to boss base select this geometry and this geometry and here select the path see this path we selected here okay now it's created big first part make the color yellow now select the second geometry this is also make edit this also make half not full so just uh, create center line exit trim entity and trim this half line okay now exit so bottom half we created now for choose right plane sketch normal now here we will create the another part first select this line convert entity choose line and connect up to 
here exit now choose three point arc create a beak up to like this dimension is up to you whatever you keep now exit <coughs> now select here <coughs> lifted boss base loop select this corner and select this corner select okay ah uh, okay choose here path <coughs> select this 3d sketch we created see 3d sketch we selected or do one thing we need to create a path here so directly select 3d sketch spline connect from here to this point exit select this try to keep below the line exit now it's try to lifted boss base first select the rectangles this one and this one now select the path path already selected so now here select unmerge result now the path and everything selected okay now see the beak is created select this beak bottom part and make the color of course yellow now it's time to mirror so choose right plane mirror select here okay is showing an error so do one thing clear go to body and select this part select here okay we selected only one beak select this second okay now see it is mirror now just hide this first geometry now see we created the beak now select right plane sketch right plane sketch normal select here Three point arc. Select offset. Or cancel it. Again, choose three point arc. Just connect it. We want to create a tail. or better draw one by one
थ्री पॉइंट आर लाइन आई विल नॉट कीप द डायमेंशन अदरवाइज इट विल टेक टू मच टाइम सो आई जस्ट सिंप्लीफाई एंड प्रेजेंट इट टू यू सेलेक्ट एक्सक्लूडेड बॉक्स कीप मिड प्लेन सेलेक्ट फोर एम एम and keep the black color okay now again try right plane sketch and connect it exit select revolve boss base select this line as a axis okay now select this part red okay again choose right plane sketch normal we want to create one more tangent revolve boss base okay let's make the same color red okay now see here i change some dimensions you can also do it according to your requirement now we want to distribute this body in two parts so that we will apply a different color so let's say let's see choose top plane plane and create one plane 40 mm below okay now select this plane and choose front plane so press control key plane now select here axis now see here we want to create one axis okay now select this axis and press control key and tap top plane so axis and top plane and we need to create one more plane see keep the angle 111 degree see okay now hide this plane now the plane is created so hide this axis also now select this plane sketch normal first make a center line make sure it is vertical now choose here three point arc exit now select the both the end of arc and center line and make relation symmetric okay okay uh, it's up to you whatever you want let's say okay 47 mm nearly 
now select here split line now this line already selected now select the face this face we selected projection ok now see here we created two face this one and this face now hide this plane now it's time to assign the color so select back surface and uh, apply any high gloss white plastic and select the top face and apply red color ok see this is the, our beautiful angry bird see this is bottom and upper part so i wish you enjoyed please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks don't forget to share and like this videos thanks for watching